Good day. I am Hannah Nicole Ibernal from BSHM CSM 11. In this video, we will solve a problem using Polly's problem solving strategies. The first problem is the number of girls. There are 364 first grade students in Park Elementary School. If there are 26 more girls than boys, how many girls are there? Applying the four steps of Polly's problem solving strategy, the first one is we need to understand the problem. In this step, we need to restate the problem in our own words or much better if we translate it into Tagalog for us to easily understand the problem. So, Park Elementary School has a total of 364 first grade students. The problem is that we need to figure out how many girls there are if there are 26 more girls than boys. The second step is we need to devise a plan. What appropriate strategy do you think we need to solve this kind of problem? So we will write an equation. If we represent the number of boys by b, then b is equals to boys and b plus 26 is equals to girls. To get the answer, we will use the equation b plus b plus 26 is equals to 364. Carrying out the plan is the third stage. To begin, write the equation b plus b plus 26 is equals to 364, which can be simplified to 2b plus 26 is equals to 364. After that, substitute 26 on the right side and we'll make 2b is equals to 364 minus 26. And the answer for dot is 338. Lastly, divide both sides by 2. The answer would be 169. Therefore, the number of boys is 169. Next, we must determine the number of girls using the formula B plus 26, which will give us 169 plus 26 equals 195 girls, since our B is equals to 169. The last step is to review the solution. Since B represents the number of boys, 169 boys plus 195 girls is equals to 364. And based on the problem, there should be 26 more girls than boys. Therefore, the correct answer is 195 girls, which proves that the solution used is correct. Once again, I am Hannah Nicole Ibernal from BSHM CSM 11. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something.